LaptopKey.com, your source for replacement keyboard keys. Notice, when trying to repair your laptop keyboard keys, searching by the laptop brand and model may not always be enough information. Many times laptop manufacturers produce keyboards that look the same on the outside, however have differences underneath the keys. The differences include the hinges, retainer clips, and cup color. To help you find the correct tutorial for your key, we have created a searchable database at LaptopKey.com. Simply go to LaptopKey.com, select your laptop brand, model number, and then a visual list of key types will appear. Select the video tutorial that matches your key. That's all. You're now ready to fix your keyboard. All right, let's install your keys onto your keyboard. Start out by looking at the plastic pieces that are on the keyboard that make fittings or holes. So you can see that there's two larger ones here at the top corner and two smaller ones at the bottom corner. But make sure to look at the different keys because they can change position. Um, the larger holes can be to the left, at the bottom, or to the right. So the position of those holes is uh, going to determine the position of these pieces here. So what you want to do now is click these two pieces together and uh, start out with the larger piece. You can see that it has two large sticks at the top corners. Those have to go wherever the two large holes are. If the large holes are to the right, then you change this accordingly. Bottom, left, or right, whatever. In this case, they're at the top, so you put it those sticks at the top. Um, also make sure not to put the whole piece upside down like that by feeling underneath the sidebars. If you feel a little bump there, that has to face the keyboard and on top it's just smooth so now you know the position of that piece you put it down in the right position for now so you can look at the next piece which is this you can see that at the bottom it has two sticks so they're gonna go wherever the uh, small the small holes are in this case they're at the bottom so you know to face that accordingly also and you can see it has two small sticks in the middle those are going to click into the middle holes of the larger piece here and now make sure not to put this whole piece upside down by feeling underneath the sidebars same thing if you feel a bump that has to face the keyboard so now you know position for both pieces. What you want to do is you put the small piece underneath the larger piece and just put it right through like that. Okay, now what you want to do is click the two side holes that are on the small piece into the holes that are on the larger piece. You do that by just separating the two the sidebars here of the small piece so that the sticks can actually go into the holes of the larger piece now this is all one piece what you want to do is I start out with the um, larger sticks I put those in the large holes once you have that you lay the whole thing flat and you want to uh, push the plastic pieces downward not against the keyboard but you want to stretch the plastic pieces so that the bottom sticks can go into the bottom hole then uh, you just push in make sure they click once they do click you get your key put it right in the center and push down evenly on all four sides and there you go. LaptopKey.com
Your source for replacement keyboard keys.